Howdy folks, Doc here with Last Best Tool. And I really like these Milwaukee wrenches. However, as I was building out my set slowly based on need, I picked up the 15 millimeter and this part of it felt great. This is how it was, you know, hanging in the store and I could feel it. Uh, but this here, I noticed didn't have that Milwaukee smoothness. Something was wrong. I mean, these are just silky smooth all the way around. This thing, immediately I thought, this is kind of rough on the edge. And I looked at it really close, uh, and the finish work is not near as good. I'm going to actually do another video with it under the microscope, uh, because it's got some, some pretty significant issues. Uh, you can barely see kind of the chrome isn't very good. Uh, back here, there's drips. Uh, but there's also some pitting, or it looks like holes that have some sort of filler in them. You know, here's another spot. You can see the chrome. It's not chipped out. It's, I don't know if the camera will focus this close, but it's actually a uh, covered pit. So the chrome is actually like covered or covering um, some defect. And I noticed some other defects inside here. And when you look really close under the microscope, it looks like there's some sort of filler inside the holes. And then they uh, just left it at that. But there's rough spots on this guy. I mean, that's not, you know, banging around in a toolbox or something. It's actually some kind of a, you know, bad chroming. Anyway, and this one really surprised me. So Milwaukee, uh, even though they've got their professionally made in Taiwan, um, Apparently, there's some quality control issues, so if you're going to get a set of these, really look at them close, because all of these, these other ones that I have are just silky smooth. I looked at them under the microscope. You know, they're really quite good uh, in their finish work, especially compared to some others, um, like Craftsman. Snap-on, again, looks really elegant under a microscope, so there is a big difference there. But this guy here... Something happened. This one slipped through. I don't think it should have, or maybe Taiwan, uh, the manufacturing plant, has got some ways they kind of cover up errors. Um, but anyway, so I've got a link to the video, uh, the microscope video below, and uh, you can let me know what you think. But if you've got a set of these, are yours perfect, or are they harboring imperfections? This one's just, it's got a bunch of defects. I mean, it has... You know, as far as individual defects, way more than all these combined. So, anyway, I'm just curious. Is this just a one-off, or are they slipping through? And with that, Doc out.